Do what? I... I don't think I could do either. I'm claustrophobic and afraid of heights. I'm sorry, what was the question? Skydive or scuba dive, and you have to pick one, Penny. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, no, no I don't. Oh yeah, you do. I didn't say skydive, scuba <laughs> dive, or neither. I said skydive or scuba dive. <laughs> Uh, fine, skydive. Okay. Whoop. I would have to say skydive too. You doctor? Yep. All right, let me fill you in on the situation. Found this man in the scene of a uh, blown up vehicle. I'm assuming he might be severing some extreme trauma. Uh, it seems it appears he is handcuffed for your safety and ours. Uh, he had an assault weapon in his unconscious hands near a blown up vehicle, so I have my suspicions. I checked for pulse, wasn't getting any feedback, so I figured I'd bring him to you guys where you had more equipment to handle this. Okay. So you can provide him with some medical attention. Uh, so I'm gonna recheck that pulse. Uh,. Yes, this is Dr. Craig. This is the first day he's um, technically on job in the city. I'm Penny, by the way, Dr. Craig. Okay, I'm detecting a faint pulse. Pretty thready, but it is there. Alright. You sure? Give me time. Alright. So we're going to try a few things. I'm going to try 0.5 of atropine. We're going to try and get him conscious again. Um, Penny, would you mind getting an IV? Hey. All right, looking good. If you don't mind drawing up uh, 0 0.5 milligrams of atropine. Alright, looks good. Alright, in the meantime, I'm going to use these pads. I said, yep, the pads. I'm going to start pacing them. Uh, do you want me to move the cruisers in, in the way? Uh, you know, it's fine. I'm kind of using it to lean on right now. Okay. I just didn't want, you know, getting you guys away. So, just for understanding, say, uh, we've attached pacer uh, pads to him, and we will be trying to electrically make his heart beat, essentially. Oh, so you're going to shock him with the paddles? It's just kind of like a continuous shock at what we need him to do. So right now yeah, it's at 60 a minute. Got a little blood. Okay, start a line for me. Wait, hold on. No, don't. We, we already have a line. Don't start fluids just yet. I'm worried it's a pump problem and not a uh, not a volume problem. Maybe if we get him pumping again, maybe that uh, blood pressure will go back up for us. Good idea on the oxygen. Maybe some uh, vitals for me, Penny? Alright, his, his blood pressure's low, pulse is faint, but... Alright, Paul, uh, the, uh, fa 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 fa, can't speak. Okay. So it doesn't look like the pacing's doing a whole lot, so we're going to try uh, dopamine for a little bit, see if we can't get him back up. And we'll just hang some dopamine, see if that works out. He's looking like he wants to get up. Oh. <sighs> Oh. All right. Howdy. Oh, take it easy, sir. You'll be okay. Oh. You might want to sit down. 
Oh, my hands hurt. I feel like they're tied behind my back. Oh, they indeed are, sir. Why? Uh, I found you laying unconscious next to a vehicle with an assault weapon, class 3 in your hands. Next to a blown up vehicle. Oh, Any, uh, that. I mean, I know you suffered some yep. major head trauma, so I don't suppose oh, you yeah. really remember. Oh, what? Oh, is okay. it? Is it possible that you have foggy. him sit down somewhere so we can... Yeah, yeah, him? we can sit in the back of this uh, police cruiser if he wants. Yeah, how about we just... Yeah, I can't... How about we just chill here really for now? down here. There, I, gonna, uh... Let's just... Alright, look. Let's just I'm gonna cut you a favor. I'm gonna uncuff you. If you promise Don't. to be cooperative. Just so you can rest and take a breather. You start running. I'm gonna put a taser in your ass. You hear me? Yep. Right. I hear you. Well, we have some words that are going to need to be spoken here. Uh, hold on. A bit closer here. There we go. Why don't you have a seat there? Okay. So you just relax, sir. Uh, can I have your name? Gus. Okay, Gus. Well, my name's Dr. Craig Evans. You just hang out here. So, essentially, what happened was, uh, when you were found, your heart was not beating nearly as much as it needed to, or nearly as hard as it needed to. So we gave you a few medications and a little bit of electrical therapy, and it didn't look like it worked out until, uh, until we hit the dopamine on you. So we're just gonna hang out here for a little bit, see how you're doing. Dopamine seemed to work, so don't move too much. We still have that dripping. Uh, can you tell me what you remember? Yep, I, uh, well, it's a long story. Started, started early today. I, uh, I was doing a repair job for a mobster, which I shouldn't have done, but I Night needed crew. the money. Sorry. Night American Patriots, all right. And, uh, well, I missed this. I got, I got focused. He started... He started lipping off about my wife, and uh, well, I wasn't too happy about it, so I might have punched him in the nose, and uh, well, I've been on the run ever since, stole a car, I was in the parking lot of the mobster's place, and uh, then I went down to, uh, I went down, the police officer saw me at the strip club, uh -huh. and uh, I ran away because... As far as I understand it, that mobster has one or two people on one of the police forces in the area. Oh, okay. Has has someone on the take. So I, I was just scared and ran. I got hit by, I got hit by a motorcycle and okay. got knocked out there. And some pedestrian came by and gave me a shot of I don't know what and ah. perked me right up, dropped me off somewhere else, and. Uh, then I went. Then I saw the police, and I saw a mobster, and I was scared. And I went around behind the clothing. I think it was near the clothing store, and I parked the car I was driving beside a fence. And then I ended up jumping up on the car and oh. over the fence, and then realized the the fence that I had parked beside was was actually the gate to get out. And I was trapped in there. It was like a pen. Yeah. I was trapped. I couldn't get out at all. So what I did ended up doing was ended up shooting, and I had this gun. It's not. It's not even. I don't even think it's a legal gun. I had that from when I was inside of a police car last time I was awake, which was totally legal. I was just riding around with a cop for a few minutes. No, ended I up in the you. driver's seat when they when they got to get gas or something, and I got out anyway. So I noticed I had that on me, and then I shot. I shot at my car to try to blow it up on purpose to try to take the fence out so I could get out because I was trapped. And uh, I guess I was standing too close to the blast radius, and here we are. Well, I'd say you'd have it a, a hell of a night. So yeah, I would tend to agree on that one. Yeah, so I'm going to ask you some more medically inclined questions because I'm a doctor, and that's kinda, sure that's kind of more my business. Um, are you in any kind of pain right now? Uh, yeah, uh, 
I got some, I don't know, it feels like my my uh, my sideburns got singed off. I had sideburns down below my ears. I don't I don't feel those right now. Yeah, it looks uh, like they're gone. Back of my neck's a little, yeah, back of my neck's a little tingly. I must have got a, what do you call it, one of those coup contra coups, you know, where you hit your your head on the front and then the back and the front again kind of thing. Yeah, good, from the explosion. Uh, good terminology there. Well, I learned that one because my uh, sister's a, a nurse, and I helped her study for medical school, so I learned a lot. Yeah. So, you know, might be a minor concussion, but you'd be better equipped to tell me about that kind of stuff. Yeah, there's a nice uh, bag for you for the time being. Okay. All right. Thank you. Going uh, go down the list I don't mean here. to interrupt, Doc. I just, real quick, Gus, if I step over there and call in a radio and let dispatch know what's going on, you're not going to run off, are you? No, I'm not. I mean, I feel like this has come to a conclusion now. I feel like there's no point in running anymore. I mean, you know what's going on, and no, I don't I know. I understand everything. I don't think you need yeah. to be in cuffs at this point. I'll, I'll just, just stay right know, here. You can you trust to me afraid. to do it. All right. No, I, I feel safe thing. with the doctors and the and the wall here and kind of right. locked in. All right. Take it easy, all right? Yeah, okay. I'll be right uh, here. Dr. Craig, uh, yeah. what, what medication would you prescribe for him to take right now, considering his drip, or just the drip? I want to get the rest of this history down, and then I'll, uh, I'll think of a good med for him. All right. Okay. All right. Thanks. Um, now, uh, you said your name was Gus? Yeah, Gus Zelinski. Okay, Gus. Um, are you allergic to anything, sir? Uh, yeah, horses. Uh, my my aunt had a, had a horse farm when I was growing up. Okay, horses. And, uh, yep, yep, definitely allergic to horses. Horse hair, horse, you know, horse blankets, horse saddles, things like that. Anything that's horse been near hooves. a horse. Like a, probably their hooves. Okay. And probably uh, any hay that's been around a horse. Okay. I so, think I might be allergic to uh, to grass. And pollen, any kind of and grass. leaves, uh, yeah, crab grass. Yeah. Uh, what is it? What's that? Blue grass. Blue. Not grass. the music, but the there's an actual. It's like Carolina blue grass. I don't know what it is, but okay, it's some I'll sort of grass. Down. I'll put it down that you like the music, though. Uh, it's not bad. It's not little, bad. Little uh, Ricky, little Ricky Skaggs. Oh yeah. It's okay. Um, let's see here. I think I think that's good. Anyway. On allergies. I think that's good on Okay. Uh, let's talk. All right. Are you ta are you taking any form of medications right now? Yep. I'm on uh I'm on two two pills for blood pressure. Uh Lipitor for what is that? Cholesterol or something? I don't yep. know. Lipitor is yep. one of them. Uh Let's see here. I had a uh I had a valve replaced in my heart 2 years ago. Well, that'll do. Um it. Add some sort of infarction or something. You in uh, the medical terms tonight. I'm very impressed. Oh, I'm sorry. It's my sister because she's a nurse. Yeah. So I just learned. I'm sure you know, and Helping I just sort of study. paid attention to that. Yeah, I helped her study yep. a little bit for that. Uh, so a couple medications like some niacin. Uh, let's see here. A few other things, but uh, yep, it's uh, mostly for blood pressure, uh, my heart, a little bit. Um, <laughs> Viagra. <laughs> okay, all good. Uh, what's the last thing you ate or drank? I had uh, thirteen sliders. Okay. At uh, Burger Shot. All right. The ones with bacon, chicken, cheese, and avocado on it, all, and also all, the burger all as well. Thirteen of them had bacon, cheese, and avocado on them. Yeah, and mayo. Oh, okay. And uh, fried onions. Uh huh. Uh, and I want I had all those medium rare. Okay, good. And uh, I also asked them to uh, to dip each burger in the deep fryer for five seconds. That's about it. Understood. Uh, did you have anything then also to drink on that, that on the yes, I did. I had an extra large. Um, let's see here, extra large root beer, uh -huh. uh, the kind that doesn't have caffeine though, because I don't like to get all excited. So uh, it's like a mug root beer, I think they serve there. I, I it's pretty so. good. And then, 
Yeah, and then on the side, I had the uh, had the pasta salad uh-huh. uh, with extra mayo, and I had the what do they call those little deep fried curly critters or curly squirrels or something? Something like they're that. like a, a cinnamon fries? twist. I'm no, no, no. That. It's like a dessert. It's like a cinnamon twist, crunchy, crispy churro thing. I don't know what it is, but yeah. it's uh, it's all right. So that was my dessert, as well as a cherry's jubilee and two apple pies, and an ice cream sundae, and uh, that had uh, cherries, <laughs> sprinkles, yeah. nuts. I won't lie, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> it was good. It was uh, a good meal. It only cost me. Just... Only cost me fifty-six dollars. So. It was a good deal. Pretty cheap. Okay. Um, we talked about mm-hmm. what happened leading up to it. So, um, you said just feeling a little bit of uh, soreness in your neck and back. Yeah, a little bit in the neck, a little bit in my my head, like my brain. Also, uh, li- yeah, just right in the back of the neck there, a okay. little pinch feeling, yep. and a uh, little bit of I don't know, it's like heartburn or something, probably because just because all that food, yeah. and then I was being thrown around a lot. It happened. I've been really nervous and scared. Okay, um, so uh, if you could rate that uh, pain or discomfort on a scale of zero to ten, what would you put it at? Oh, I'd say about a well, about a three. I mean, I went through that. I didn't have a heart attack, but I had like an event, and that was insane pain. That was like an elephant sitting on my neck. My chest kind of feeling, so that was worse than and this. How, so how did you say this is not bad. Okay, not bad, not bad. A four. Like a it's four? about a four. Okay, all right. Yeah, it's about a four compared to the heart problem I had. So it's not too bad. I can, you know, I get cuts and scrapes and bruises all the time working on people's cars and air conditioning units and that kind of thing. Okay, so uh, right now for your pain and discomfort. I don't think it's anything that needs to get seriously checked out inside, but I think at the very least we're going to be looking at, uh, we're likely looking at some ibuprofen. And, uh, okay. if Penny has some on her, she will, uh, set you up with some. Great. As for everything else, um, I would be, yep. I'm not in my place, though I am a doctor. Maybe, uh, some dietary changes to, uh, you know, keep the pressure off that stent you got in there. Do you think I should take the uh, the avocado off the sliders? Yeah, maybe. Because I know there's a lot of fat, a lot of fat in the avocados. It might be your best bet. Maybe the mayonnaise. Maybe the mayo Less too. Mayonnaise. Ooh, do I really have to? I would push just, the mayonnaise. Just light mayonnaise, very, very, very light. What am I gonna get for the? What do I? What? What am I gonna? How am I gonna have the? What? Like the creaminess, okay, you know? The the deep fry. You know fry, the creaminess. Maybe, maybe not too deep fry. Don't deep fry it. Maybe you could have a mm-hmm. milkshake, and, and that would replace uh, the creaminess. Like, perhaps fat, like fat-free mayonnaise. Oh no, fat-free mayonnaise is a joke because they just put sugar in it instead of the fat, and the sugar just becomes fat later. So it's—I mean—that's not really helpful. If you think about it. You know, oh, I've been liking that new uh, olive oil mayo. It's pretty good. Maybe mm-hmm. I could switch to that. Has that got more? Is it extra virgin, or is that just straight up? Do you make it yourself, or is that pre-made? Oh, no, you can get it pre-made. It's pretty good. I mean, it tastes just like mayo. Uh, you know, the olive oil is a little bit of a better trans fat for you. The hell okay. Do you? Help, so I'll switch yeah. to that. Stuff like that. Just watch. watch okay, just little intake. changes. Little changes. Watch my mayo intake, limit that, less deep frying of the sliders, no avocados, and switch to uh, olive oil mayo. Now, yeah, now, last question uh, regarding the stent. How long ago was that placed? Uh, a couple years back, maybe two, okay, two so and a half, with, three, some, two. You're done with your year of blood thinners then? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. the blood's not thinner anymore. It's thick as a... Uh, Thick as a sewer line, I guess. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, yeah, definitely take Real that ibuprofen. Okay. And, Will uh, do. I think my wife has some at home, too. All right, perfect. So you don't even need to run to the store. I would get home as soon as possible. Rest. Get some icy hots, maybe. Icy hots do me good. And uh, definitely... Icy hots? Yep. You ever had one? Shit. Sure. Yeah, I do. I have had that before. That's nice. It there. feels good. I put it on my lower back. But I'm feeling a little, uh, 
feel bloated, you know, from uh, too much ice cream. I do it when I lift heavy patients. Well, so that yeah, makes sense. Yep. So, I mean, we're on the same page. So maybe some icy hots. Keep on that ibuprofen for the neck and back. And um, some little changes with your diet. Okay, I'll definitely be doing that. A few little changes. Uh, yep. I'll make that happen for sure. Thanks for your help. I mean, I've been through some devastating injuries tonight. So, I appreciate you. Glad, glad you're feeling better. Yes, thank you. And you did you did a nice job there, both uh, all of you, with the medical stuff. Even you, officer, as a deputy, I should say, sheriff, deputy. Uh, great job. I have all good. Saved my life. Appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> as long as you're okay. Good okay. job. I'm sure you have some questions for me. Uh, yeah, yeah, from yeah. Uh, too much screen. We're gonna bow out yeah. here, Doctor Doctor Craig. Out. All right, thanks a lot. Appreciate you. All good. Have well, that night. makes sense. See ya. Take care. All right, Gus. If you don't mind, just hopping in the back here with me. We'll uh, run down and talk to the captain real quick. Clear all oh. this up. <laughs> I'll sit in the front. I always feel That's more comfortable fine. up here. <laughs> Okay. So, I'm I'm not sure where that lady in the river was, but I mean, she doesn't give me the location. The river's big place. Nothing I can do, you know. I mean, that's all you get. I mean, if you're not gonna help us out, we can help you out. You know, whose question is it, by the way? Mm. Did you ask the question? Oh, you asked the, the uh, uh, scuba dive. And, and, yeah, skydiver, uh, scuba dive, and I believe Penny said skydive. Yeah. I would say skydive. Okay, I'm feeling it. Scuba diving can be uh, scary. Yes, I can. So I'm thinking, um, if we're going down the line, it's pennies next. Uh, man down, man down. Oh, oh, we got. Oh, that that might be. Oh, you can take it. That's yeah. going to be dangerous. Benny, how we doing, love? It's okay, I have a class 3 firearm. Well... Evans! And the night is picked up as soon as I'm trying to get off. Fuck. I do this every time. We're gonna get creative. I know where the clitoris is now. No. Jail, Papa, jail. Sliders always have pickles. It's such a default. Come on. So much gunfire. Shit. I'm in for a fun one. Where the hell's the clubhouse? Also, what's up, Wild Khaleesi? I haven't been looking. I said Khaleesi because of my buddy Chuck Khaleesi at work. Um, what's up, Wild Khaleesi? I have not been paying attention to chat at all. So, I got really into that for a bit. Started going down the old algorithm, and he was doing the classic, I'm the patient who's going to talk about everything for five minutes. No, he did that really well. I'd be heavily surprised if he didn't have some kind of medical background. That was Bo, though.
I'm just gonna beat him up. Oh dear. Cause Timber saw you. <sighs> Timber saw you. Okay, is everybody okay? Timbers. Can we put those away, please? Is that so? We have a right to pretty much will them. It's a stun gun. It's not an actual gun. I was scared, okay. Yeah, and Who's Pepper's been, tr been, tre been, been trespassing, what, three times now? Three times on our property? I'm not really counting, okay? Not really counting. Well, you can guarantee we're pressing fucking trespassing charges. Yeesh. Uh, to have you not be on our fucking property, on our roof? Earning my paycheck uh -huh. tonight. Domina, can you go find out where that gentleman went? I just saw him kind of go into the clubhouse. What up? Uh... Oh, shit. Ah, uh, Pepper! If you Oh, oh, you got him. Good shit. Oh my god, Nate! Uh, I was here sewing on my new patches and... Uh, what happened? Uh, fucking fire fight. Get, hold on, Nate. Fuck. You get hit? <laughs> yeah, everywhere. Where at? I can't see My that. everything got hit, Doc. You're in Front, rough shape. back, ass cheek. Pretty sure half my balls are gone. I'm gonna check your balls real quick. Oh, you better. Thank you. Nope, you got both of them. You're good. You're good. Alright, I'm just gonna patch up what I can from here now. Oh, thank you. We're gonna start. We're gonna do this in multiple waves, okay? I'm gonna start yeah. by ba uh, bleeding control. Now we're gonna do what I call rapid fire suturing. I know it looks like I'm sunbathing, but I'm really not. No, you look uh, like you're just yeah. taking a, a much needed break from standing up. Oh my god. I'm gonna kinda field treat you here because this scene is kinda shady. Uh it's not that bad, man. I'm I just hearing a lot of gunfire, partner. I I don't like it. That's because, uh, motherfuckers. Hey. Ow. Fuck. A lot of people have to trespass. Ugh. Was the trespassing really worth all this? Uh, I guess. Uh. uh, Doctor, I'm gonna need you to, uh, not that I'm, I'm gonna need you to call for some backup here, because we got two more men down. Then being right over my cars over there. Oh my god, that's Amp horrible. Jesus, fuck. Alright, call it in. Doc, I'm gonna level with you. I actually had three balls. Motherfucker. Three what? Holy shit, you do. Three testy. Oh, they're all there. Oh, good. E.T.'s still there, that's good. You call them E.T.? Extra testicle. Dude, that's, uh, that's actually pretty tits. We'll get you out of here. Look at that. Sit tight, okay?
Jesus. Oh my god. I must be hallucinating. I just saw the doctor running with a fucking golf club. Oh, it's my doctor club. It's all good. That's oh besides god, the point. Oh god, thank god. Please don't probe me with that doctor. No, it's not, it's not for probe. It's for doctrine. <laughs> oh, okay, good. Um, by the way, Doc, you might want to take a look at Maggie. She sustained multiple gunshot wounds to her lower pelvis area. She I, might need some ibuprofen. I haven't, oh, just, haven't oh been able to find... God. Holy shit. I was not Yeah. Lying. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. I need it. I you probably must... need to sit down too. Yeah, you must be Maggie. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Fuck. Oh. 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 Yeah, there we go. Oh. Holy crap. Alright, sit tight. We're gonna oh, just take a look. I'm gonna do the same thing I did for uh, your buddy here. Yeah. Nate, what the fuck happened here? Uh, fucking. Trespassing piece of shit. Oh my god. I heard, I heard people. Uh, I let Derek know, but sooner or later I have to leave, right? Just don't tell me you have three here. balls like your buddy. No, she's <laughs> she's just got the biggest swing of dick you'll ever see. Just, just <laughs> fucking kill you with it. Okay, do you have I'm it? I'm gonna go see this dead guy in the fucking road, though. I don't oh, see. Why don't you? God. Why don't you stay out of the road now? I'm okay, no. Doc. Don't worry about me. I think, I'm, um, I think mostly it's my right side here. I think okay. I think I got, I got shot my right side. Yeah. Um, Nate, moving this vehicle out of the out of the road. Holy shit! Oh my god! Not right. the first gunshot wound I've had before, Doc. That's not exactly. Did you get the other guys? I got two here, though. Um, you said there was one more? Does anyone have any pills? Uh, there's two more. Uh, Pepper, just stay here. Everyone, just keep your distance. Uh, doctor, yeah. come with me. Alright, you sutured up for the time being. I gotta check this out, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go try to, go try to help now. Yep. Doctor Club. Cheating on Val. Buh. This looks like our site. The hell happened? Oh, what happened with this one? Same deal? I believe they were all part of gang violence. Alright. Just wanted to watch a race, that's it. Oh. Oh, is there for you shot? shots? Yes. Where? I was shot. I was at the shot in my hip and my upper shoulder. My right side. It hurts. Okay. All right, I see him. I'm going to do the same thing I've been doing for you guys. I'm going to start by controlling that bleeding, and then I'm going to do what I can to quickly uh, shut it up, okay? Oh, Jesus. I had to make sure you were sitting down for this. All right, so at least at the very at this very moment, we are good on bleeding. Um, Did Pepper run? I just wanted you to know, no, Peppa is there, but I think she uh, she has an unregistered fire on that needs to be checked at because she was just mm -hmm. showing it off in the streets. Stand for. I really don't like her. Okay. We're just gonna... We're just gonna kinda close you up here. Yeah, Thank I'm you. A, I'm a chameleon. We'll get you there. You got a medical kit on you? Negative. Kinda using them up. I do not have one on me, unfortunately. I had to use mine to uh, my, get the my, first... My... I didn't... 
friend back there. He was he was here watching the race with me. He might have one on him. I'll take a look. That guy over there. Yeah, we were both watching the race and heard gunshots, and we sure. came and the next thing you know, oh, we're shit. getting destroyed. I know. Uh, no, I just sir? used my I just used my last one to patch my name is, is, is one Barry. Barry, do you got a last name for me? Walker. Ooh, yeah, yeah, Barker. Wal let's, Walker. Let's... Walker. Let's get okay. it. Uh, you got a med kit for me? Uh, I could get one right now, real quick. I Let got. Go uh, get a car. I got my uh, backup coming in with one. I got something that can help. I always come prepared. We always keep the 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 the, the MC stock. You gonna toss me one? Oh. Sorry, I should have given it to you. <laughs> I'll just supervise. Um, it, uh, yeah, to supervise me here. Nice, Sorry, nice. I can't really, I can't really uh stop what I'm doing. Oh, All what right. was that in his hand? All right, sir. At this time, I am going to have to detain you. I understand. Do you do you comply? I'm still highly injured. I understand, sir, and we will get you medical attention. Do not worry. Uh, Timbers, this I was, guy I was, was put... caught snooping in the clubhouse earlier today. Oh. Davis was called to the scene. All right, well. I had, I was, to... I... We're going to go ahead and uh, bring you down to the PD for questioning, where we will have medical attention on scene for you, sir. That would be great. All weapon, right, and at this time. I have, I, have a, I have a weapon on me from earlier. All right, all right. I was riding um, in a cop car. I was un all right, all right. so it kind of appeared on me. I don't have any guns that are legal, so I'm going on to the scene of a gang violence. I'm just going to bring my club. God, God damn time. Let's go. Go, 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 go. I'm almost dead. Go, get out of here. What the shit was that? Dude, we just got. Got in a, a high end sports car and just took off after yeah. she threatened to kill me. Uh, well, the suspenders guy from earlier was the one down in the tunnel. He was the one <laughs> with like Pepper. Is anybody else crazy fucked? Where is that suspenders guy? He's being arrested right now because he had a gun when... Yeah, you know what else out. that private investigator did? You'll never fucking believe it. What'd I do? She shot out this fucking tire right in front of me, too. Yeah. Goddamn psychopath. Timbers, uh, between... Timbers, uh, Pepper ran off in, on a, in a sports car. Yeah, she shot out the tire <sighs> of whoever's SUV that is, too. It was a yellow and blue sports car. Started heading down towards the road that direction. I want a word um, with suspenders. Okay, are we all good here? I... Yeah, you're okay I'm... to head out of here, Doctor. I think. You might need to give yeah. him a ride. I just, she did shoot the shit. I don't know if this is your car, Doc, but she shot it. Why'd she do that to my car? <sighs> uh, do, we have, do we have multiple of you that can say she shot it if I need to yes. call you guys in later? Yeah. Okay. Fuck. I just... All right. And, I was, uh, I was 